the horse that won against all the odds. So buy and fold. We buy to sell and we breed to sell. I gave them a very small budget, 2,000, that was it. And I thought, you know, we'd get them sold. Thomas and David took the horse to the sales. And she just said, Dad, disaster. What are we going to do? But he had to be sold. That's when we had to go to Plan C. We hadn't planned for this, but they had no option. First day we gave him a canter. I knew that he, was, that he had something. We set off anyway, all excitement. Losing action at the back, about to be pulled up, is Gordon Lord Byron. The horse ambulance was down. We saw his our colours. That was horrible. Like the horse was absolutely hobbling lame. Nothing had gone straight forward. Things had been quite doom and gloomy. You know, Dad had just recovered from being sick and then Mum became sick. I wasn't very well and I was just finishing my chemotherapy. We had no idea what was going to come with this fella. And then he was able to start walking again. He was ready to run again. It was incredible, really, when you think about it. I nearly exploded. I just, the, the feeling, the, it was absolutely incredible. All of a sudden, illness is forgotten about and um, the whole thing changes. And instead of trundling off for chemo, which we had to do for a while, we now trundling off out to Hong Kong, Dubai. Come on, 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 come on. When everybody can compete at listed, at listed uh, company, the time that to, to got it off.